Hello everyone, Scott Stone Bill coming to you live from Oahu. I'm in Holly Eva. It's September 3rd, 2015, 7.41 in the morning. We're talking about how you can make yourselves more conversational. I'm gonna give you a tip, I'm gonna give you a hint. I'm gonna give you a hint. Can you learn conversational sales at a bar? Can you learn conversational sales at a bar? And I, I'm gonna hope you say yes. So here's one of the things that I do when I, I work with uh, salespeople, and it's just a little bit different than normal sales training, but that's perfectly fine and normal. So one of the things that I do with them is I'll get them to sit down and we'll go grab like some Henry Weinhardt's root beers, root beer, not beer, root beer. And I'll tell the guys, hey, look, just, or girls, they could be girls in the class too. Just have a conversation with me. Tell me about what you did last weekend. And there's something about people just hanging out like if they were gonna be drinking a beer or a root beer that gets them into like a, a conversation mode more than it gets them into a sales mode. So we've talked about bullets, we've talked about scripting. And one of the things that'll happen is with them sitting there having a root beer in their hand, it just becomes more conversational. It reminds them of what it's like to sit at a bar and have a conversation and, and just talk with somebody. And that's one of the better ways to get past all the filters and all the things that are going on. You put up against a salesperson who can have a conversation versus somebody who uses all the tactics and strategies. All those tactics and strategies can only take you so far, but they also build up resistance in the mind of the buyer, creating a problem, which means that more tactics and strategies have to be used to deal with the resistance that's been created. It just becomes this evolving circle. But one of the things that you're gonna find is that the person feels like you have a connection with them. And I'm not talking like crazy rapport, like we're gonna go fishing at the end of the week because that never happens, right? <clears throat> but just a really good, strong, solid connection. I will label it rapport, but not super crazy rapport because that'll lead to, to just having all sorts of problems, all right? But just that good connection, that good ability to talk back and forth doesn't mean that the sale is gonna automatically be made. It still means that all the processes have to be followed. It still means that there's a bunch of things that have to be done, but it makes it a whole lot easier. So like two dudes at a bar, or a dude and a chick at a bar, it makes it so much easier for you to make the sale happen, okay? So if you're struggling, you're like, I'm having a tough time getting the person to buy in. Role play, go buy some bottles of root beer, right? Not beer because it makes it a little bit more difficult to remember what happened, but go get some bottles of something, right? But just have it like the shape of a beer bottle. So there's different brands out there. There's a company out here on the North Shore, it's Vailua, Vailua uh, uh, Root Beer Company. They got a, a dancing girl in a, in a hula skirt. That's pretty good beer. Uh, Virgil's is pretty good root beer. Um, there's plenty of different other root beers out there. A lot of stores have like the micro crafts and the brews. I mean, you're gonna find a lot of different places. So go grab a bottle of root beer or a six pack, sit down and just have the conversation with whoever you need to have it with. I'm, I know it sounds a little bit different, but that's all right. You're gonna have an okay time. You're gonna be better at sales, okay? So two people at a bar having a beer is way better than like me having to script out everything using all sorts of crazy tactics and strategies. Now, if you could do a small favor for me in the box down below, leave a comment, question, or story, that'd be fantastic. To the right or to the left, there's a subscribe button. Subscribe and then send it out to all your friends via StumbleUpon, Facebook, Twitter, Google Plus, LinkedIn, Scott Sullivan Bell. Only Scott Bell with Sullivan. We'll see you soon. Thanks for watching. Aloha.